we are taking a look outside McCall right now. They are waking up to fresh snow on the ground floor, but we're waking up to snow here in the Treasure Valley as well. Just maybe not as quite as much of it. And also it's melting because it's a little bit warmer down here. Now it's 28 degrees out there. It's got a little bit of a breeze going on. We're seeing far more significant wind speeds in the valleys this morning and along the I-84 corridor. Now temperatures right now aren't too bad. We're looking at 44 degrees there in Boise, 36 in Caldwell, 35 Mountain Home, 32 in Glensbury, 43 in Twin Falls. So all these areas are really generally above that freezing point. So when precipitation comes down, it's really going to come down in the form of rain while our higher elevations are going to be seeing snow today. Now taking a look at those wind speeds, we're seeing them already pretty significant there in Boise at 23 miles per hour, 37 in Twin Falls. So it is going to be a breezy day today here for the Magic Valley, but really up the I-84 corridor as well, including Owyhee County. So of course it does feel colder outside than it actually is. It feels like 35 in Boise right now. It really feels cold here in our mountain areas, but it feels like 31 in Twin Falls. So bundle up if you're headed out the door, prepare for some chilly conditions. Now overnight we did have a lot of moisture moving on into Idaho, North Idaho, seeing snowfall, a huge band of moisture really pushing in through central Idaho, bringing rain and snow. We're continuing to feel the impact of this low pressure system today with some scattered showers, especially in our mountain area. So as we walk through the day today, uh, on this Friday, thank goodness it's Friday, right? We're going to continue to see that precipitation, especially in our higher elevations. So mountains are going to continue to see that snow build up. Driving conditions aren't going to be great today in higher elevations, but we're going to have a little bit of uh, cloud cover going on as well. Overcast conditions. Now tomorrow things really clear out, so we're going to have a nice day ahead for our Saturday, which is it, which is nice to see. Overall today, we're looking at temperatures in the upper 40s. We'll have a chance of precipitation this morning and then once again this afternoon. Uh, so definitely prepare for off and on showers in the Treasure Valley today. The, wind, the West Central Mountains, we're really dealing with that winter storm advisory. So we're going to see snow coming down today. We've got a 100% chance of that in Cascade, a high of 36 degrees. And we're going to see some windy conditions, which of course means blowing snow, which could, could be a hazard on the road. So again, just use caution out there today. Uh, same thing going on up here in the East Central mountains 100% chance of precipitation there in Stanley Sun Valley Haley and Fairfield those temperatures in the 30s for the most part so we'll see some snow and we'll see some mixed precipitation pretty much all day here in the East Central Mountains the Magic Valley is also going to get precipitation today Twin Falls looking like 100% chance of precipitation and Twin Falls is going to see that temperature warm up to 48 degrees so they'll see rain they'll see snow and they'll see mixed precipitation over here and that's pretty much going to continue for the most part this early morning through midday and clear out by this afternoon and evening. So good news there. Here's a look at that extended forecast. We're going to have a nice day tomorrow with precipitation returning there Sunday through Wednesday.